Now in the last lecture, we added head to the underscore app.js file. There is an important implication of this. Now we have the head element there in app.js and we of course still also have it in our page components. In index.js in the events folder, for example, I also have head. And as you see on the rendered page, both is applied. The title and description from the page component and the viewport from the underscore app.js file. And this is important. Next.js automatically merges multiple head elements. So if you set a head here in underscore app.js and then also in the page component, the content of those different head sections gets merged. Even if we would have multiple head sections here inside of a single component, the content would be merged by next.js. But of course, that means that we could also have conflicts. For example, I could have another title set here for whatever reasons. And now I set a title here and here. Now next.js automatically merges your head sections and it also resolves such conflicts. If I add multiple titles here and I reload this events page, you see only one title shows up here, not multiple titles. It simply takes the latest element if you have the same element multiple times. So if we have the title here and here, the second title wins. The same would be true for meta elements with a name attribute. If you have other head content, which is neither a title nor a meta element with the name attribute, but let's say a meta element with um, some other attributes, then you can always add a manual key here, like description, to still allow Next.js to find out if two elements are clashing. And then again, the latter one will win. Now, of course, this is redundant code here, this extra head. I just wanted to show this Next.js behavior. And it does have an important implication because it means that in underscore app.js, we can indeed also go into the head section we set up there and define a general title that applies to all pages unless it's overwritten. This ensures that we always have a title on every page, even if we forget to set a page specific one which we of course typically want to do. So here I'll then give all my pages a general title and also a general description. Again, that will be overwritten by the page specific data, but in case we don't have page specific data, then this general data would kick in. So here I have my general head set up, but if I reload this all events page, we don't see that there because we do have page specific data here and that then overrides the more general data. Because the page component is rendered after the app component, so the later head section wins and that will be the head section inside of the page component.